Well, hello, hey, hi guys, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. Alright, so in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys something for your pets, your dogs or your cats. Unfortunately, I don't have a cat, but in the near future, probably I would love to adopt one. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to make a cat tent like this. It is somewhat similar to the baby play gym that I did. However, it is a little bit different and the total cost for this cute little tent is less than 10 ringgit. So let's start. First up, we'll be needing this rounded wooden dowel and then this 1 inch stick and then a measuring tape, screwdrivers, power drills and fabric of your choice. This is the only one that I have and then you need a mini saw, sandpaper and some screws. Alright, so first up, we'll be needing this rounded wooden dowel. This is actually a mop handle that I bought for only 2 ringgit and we're going to cut it into 3 parts. Each part is about 1.5 feet and then we're going to cut them using this cute mini saw. And after you cut them, I'm going to tell you guys that you're going to leave one of the dowel about 1 inch extra. I'm going to tell you later why. And then take the wooden stick and then this one as well, we are going to measure about 1.5 feet each and we will be needing 4 of them. And after we have cut them into 4 pieces, I'm going to measure 2 inches from the top, 6 inches from the top and 1 inches from the bottom and then we're going to drill some holes. And after you have drilled the holes, it's time to sand them down. Alright, so we're going to assemble them. So take the wooden dowel and now it's time to screw them together. This one is the top part and the bottom part, I will explain to you guys why we let one of the wooden dowel an inch extra. After the top part is done, we're going to tackle the bottom part and this is the one inch extra one because if it is the same size as the other one, it won't slide in properly. And now you take the fabric of your choice, we are just going to throw this over and staple gun them. And this is the last step. So take your yarn and fill up and tie a knot at these holes. This will act as the limit extension of the tent. Alright, so that's all from me for today's video and if you guys love this kind of video, be sure to subscribe to my channel and turn the bell notification on so you will be notified every time I post a brand new video and also be sure to follow me on all of my social media, Instagram, Twitter and TikTok, all the links down below and yeah, I guess that is all from me today so bye!